Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking and today we are back in Motorsport Manager with Patrizio and Emilia who are racing for Kilrop Motors and we are very much mediocre. Yes, we are. Uh, but uh, Patrizio is hauling some ass. He is winning big against Emilia right now. He's quite a little racer, it turns out. It's good stuff. Uh, anyway, and he has the worst car, so uh, that's that's impressive. Uh, standard fare, uh, Guildford. Well, we get a new engine before Guildford, which is good because top speed. And then we also have time for a new suspension, I would hope, and some more part, maybe even our first few part improvements in performance. We shall see, though. We shall see. My pit crew is in dire need of repair. Uh, hmm. Yes, they are not rested yet. <laughs> this time around, to the interview question, who's my better driver, I had to answer Patrizio because he's just crushing her right now. Like, difference of uh, 30 seconds per race. I, I don't know where it's coming from. Well, there's an upcoming vote. Semi-sequential pit stops. Uh, vote in favor. Uh, yes, I am <clears throat> voting in favor anyway. But, but this probably has negative consequences. Uh, it might be un uh, yeah collusion. Collusion, collusion. I think the press will get wind of this. So, no, no, my vote is not for sale, but I'm going to vote for you. And our engine is done, I believe. Is it? Is it done? Come on, give the info to me. Engine build complete, 35%. So, yes, that means we do need to design a new part. We have 16 days to make it count. Medium speed corners or high speed corners? Mm, let's see if we can cram out a uh, suspension in that time. Ah, uh, they are not brilliant, are they? No, they really are not. Uh, we can get a lot to plus to maximum. It doesn't help us. And I'd rather go this way. It doesn't add any time, nor money. And also unlocks the next level, of course. So we could go this way. That would be 9.4 days. Uh, that's qu pretty quick. But let's see if maybe the rear wings are better. Do we have anything here? No. Okay. Well, that's not good. This would basically reproduce our current best component. Which is decent enough. But, yeah, not really something that's worth it. Let's see if we can do something good with the engine instead. Uh, because that will always be an issue. Or the gearbox, actually. Gearbox? Oh, Guildford, mm, top speed, yes. Uh, engine build won't be done before... Yeah, this adds so many days, so... What is the next race, though? Oh, Milano! The crazy one. The top speed only one. Maybe you should just make another engine. Or throw in a pair of brakes before. Let's see, let's take a look at the brakes. Oh, yeah, that would be nice. Plus 60. Okay, we still have 170 days. I'm just going to check something. Because it might be worth... It might be worth getting another level here. Is this... No, this is locked. Uh, let's check out... Don't, don't we already have the brake facility? Or was it suspension? I have to check my HQ. No, the brakes facility is level 1 out of 3. So for the gearboxes it was level 2. And the ah right the staff center we upgraded the staff center. All right, we could upgrade one more, but it does need to count. Um, we need to make it count. The uh, epic uh, card for the brakes is pretty good because with that one we could just make a decent season end part, something like. Uh, this, no, this is actually better, and then this, and then add this one, 
and we would be able to make a double up thing. But is that worth it? We could add more performance. This would add 35 performance on top of that. That's actually better. Oh, and this is actually better. Um, yeah, okay, no, I don't think it's worth it. Not for the brakes. Yeah, it looks like we're going with the rear wing. That gets us um, all the cards we need until the season end. Yes, these aren't super amazing. Plus 55 is re uh, that's pretty nice. Let's see what this costs. But uh, rear wings is something we are so good at already. I don't need to necessarily push that further. Uh, where we really need to catch up is gearbox and engine. And gearbox we already have the access to epic parts. But engine, it's test track. And test tracks take ages to build. So where is it? There it is. Hmm. Upgrade would take 24 weeks. 12 million, I'm not too fussed about, but 24 weeks, that's a lot of time. As uh, if I calculate that correctly, that is 168 days from now. 168 uh, mm. Okay. Perfectly fine for two days before the last race <laughs> in this season. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so that won't help us this season at all. But the cards here are just so good. They are so good. Plus 40, minus 20, minus 20, plus 40. It's great. And then we can have this one too. And we can have, as a season end part, could even have... Uh, no, this one takes too long. Plus 40 to max. This one also has plus 40 to max. Plus, but 150k. Hmm. And there are options. There are options. We do need high speed corners for the next two races, though. So, yeah, I'm going to upgrade that one. That's the best choice for now. And we do want to have. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Oh, well, this one is just two max. Uh, this, these parts, it would give us a component that is just as good as the one we already have, but with a bonus on it, a bonus of minus 25 reliability. Uh, interesting. If we go this route, then we may not even have to build a season end part, as this is so far improved. That's almost another 100 points to improve. 90, I think. Uh, so, hmm. I don't know. Now, oh, season end part could be even more powerful with this one. Problem with this build. It finishes six days before the race. And it has a reliability of five. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. All right, we're going for this one. It is a good compromise. Oh, fourth there, yeah. It's pretty good. Solid stuff. And there the rear wing was done. Just in time. Alright, four slots are available. And to me, that means that we don't have to build anything else. Or is it a risk free? No. Uh, we would have to choose this one. Okay, cool. Uh, so, what do we need next? Let's take a look into. Building another engine. Brakes will be pretty popular with the crowds over here in Milano. It's 23 days, so we might even be able to build another engine. Yes. Yeah, easy. Uh, wait a second. Nine days after the race. 18.4 days. 18.4 days. 23 days. Ooh. It's just four days worth of improvements. That's not enough. Oh, well then, I'm going with the brakes. That at least gives me another good part, uh, or great part, uh, with a bit of an added bonus. <laughs> Again, long hours. Yeah, yeah, that's that's part of the business. Both mechanics, relationships, minus five. Oh, right, yeah, fine. Oh, yeah, new sponsor. I do need a new sponsor. Oh. Oh, that's not good. 
Um, two, yeah, that's that's pretty poor. Thirteen for above is the only thing that gives us a decent payment up front. And that's nine races, so that's one hundred k per race. Yeah, all right, accept that offer. And our brake design is also done. And that gives us plenty of. Oh shit! The rear wing won't be entirely done for the race, will it? Um, but yeah, new brakes. So, what kind of design do we want to do next? So much designing this episode. This is great stuff. Okay, uh, season end parts? No, not yet. Now we have plenty of parts we still need to improve. So I think what I'm going to do is design the next engine. Yeah, that's a solid improvement. We're going with this. Politics. Here we go. Semi-sequential pit stops. Oh, a lot of people are against. Interesting. Now I'm going to vote for, like, four votes? Oh, I think so. So, will not benefit teams with high budgets. Yes, exactly. Five votes. I have the voting power. Don't forget. Uh, vote for. Continue. Yes. <laughs> Try to beat this. Fuck you all. <laughs> no! Oh no! Oh no! No, what the fuck? Seven! Oh, they beat me! How the hell are these assets? Oh, the assets beat me. And I invested five votes. Well, that, that, is, that is what happens if you laugh at them. They're all like, what the fuck is this douchebag doing? <laughs> Let's outvote him. Oh my god. It was such a nice move by them. Oh, good. We got a rear wing up to 81%. That's good enough. Two new parts, fast to fit. Very nice. And relevant ones, too. An engine and a rear wing. Exactly what we needed for this race. Beautiful. Oh, I hope it helps. I gave both of them to Patrizzi because he kicks ass. Okay, Guildford, the uh, tire shredding machine. 28 laps around the circuit. And, hmm, that means soft tires are decent enough. Again, pretty solid practice. Level 1 in qualifying, nailed the setups, and level 3 in softs and race, of course. I was just about to say, what? We're in Britain and there's no rain? But there's your rain. Okay, in qualifying. So we need to get out instantly to get our lap in before the rain starts. Yep, eight minutes left and we send them out. Oh, this will be perfect, I believe. Just about the right time. And we will be done right before the rain. Come on. There we go. One and one. <laughs> and now... There starts the rain. Oh, there were still a few that got in faster times. Wow. They even get in... Shit. <laughs> well, there's still grip on the track. That is why. We might be able to time it such that we go out right at the end where there's even higher grip. Let's try to time it perfectly. Oh no, the grip. Okay, no. Grip disappears completely. So we stay in. And the Nitro Ninja struck once again in the shadow of the rain clouds. And I'm going to go for the faster refueling once again. That's so powerful. And soft tires here. The advantage with the soft tires should be that we can push them quite a bit, at the start at least. So, yes, and high mode because we have additional fuel. Oh, and we are ready to launch. Oh, they are going ultra softs. Oh, super softs. Why do I always say that? Why do they call them so stupid? Ultra soft, super soft, and what is the fucking difference? Uh, the color. I should call them the pink tires and the red tires. 
There are a lot of people on medium tires too, though. I don't know what they're up to. That seems suboptimal. And the lights are on. They're hiding behind the roofs again. And 11 and... Oh! Are we standing still? Yes, we are standing still. We are causing a lot of... Oh! oh <laughs> damn! A lot of ping-ponging. Patrizio did have a terrible starting lap. Oh my god, he's being overtaken by everyone. Oh, someone crashed. It's just yellow flag, though. Oh, it was already your first pit stop? What the hell? That was very early. Oh, Woodford again. I think he has smoothness zero or something. How bad is he? Uh, no idea. But that that is really terrible. Hey, right, burned through his ultra softs one quarter faster than the competition. Oh, another crash! Oh, crazy! Ah, oh, come on, Patrizio, you're on the roll, taking all of them back. Yes, very nice. Uh, now we need to kind of go medium for a while, I guess. Yeah, that should be enough. Okay, that should be enough. And no one's really pushing either. That's good. They can't push on these tires. They are burning up. So, 9th and 10th. Oh, and she is really fucking close. Come on, push past. Yes. Well done. There we go. So we do have decent pace this race. Much better than I expected. Must be the new engine and rear wing and stuff. Uh, yeah, that really helps. But anyway, we are doing well. We are... Uh, well, two crashes. So if you take those out, we are just 10th and 12th. So yeah, it's partially due to the crashes. Okay, next lap is pit stop time. Yes, indeed it is. Okay, Patrizio is coming in first. Still no rain in sight. Beautiful. And uh, we just fill you up. Balanced pit stop, five seconds. Yeah, <laughs> that's a big advantage over the competition. There we go. And we're right now in second place. Uh, low fuel warning. So we need to pit you in. And we switch you over to another set of soft tires. No repairs needed. Excellent. But 11 seconds. Ninth uh, versus seven. Oh, we have to risk it, I guess. 28%. Yeah, let's try. Okay, everything went well with Patrizio. It's out in 17th, though. Oh, still so many have to pit. All the medium tire guys here. Are they actually trying to get a one-stopper? No, I can't can't think that might be the case. I would have to get another three laps out of this. Okay, right, here we come in. Here we go, all done, refueling, no errors. Yes, perfect. Out of there. Alright, out in twelfth. Patrizio <laughs> spooled to the front because of his uh, amazing refueling skills. And a lot more in the pits. Oh, eighth and ninth right now. And we're just driving and driving. Nothing really happens right now. It has split up in the teams. <laughs> uh, what, what, Woodford? What are you doing up there? You're terrible. Um, he has to pit in very soon. Because his medium tires are shot once again. Oh, someone went... Yeah, Woodford went <laughs> into the pits, as expected. There he is, out in 18th. <laughs> oh, poor soul. Poor, poor soul. But at least, I mean, he has done all his pit stops already. And he's not too far off. Oh, and now I need to actually keep track of where I am. Uh... Yeah, uh, Patrizio, you need to pit. And I think you can pit on Supersofts. Because you don't have... 
Yeah, you don't have the the tire thingy. You have the the pit stop guru instead. Um, so that's good. You don't get a bonus from soft tires anyway. So you can go on super, super soft. We do a balanced pit stop, and we would be out in 14th. All right. So here we come. Patrizio is going in. And switch, and... No! Fuck. Little mistake. Two seconds, okay. Ah, fucking hell. That's two seconds. Right there. Now we have way too much fuel. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, yeah. Burn it. Burn it. Oh, we only have an engine of 41%, though. So it might be difficult to burn it. There are a few repairs going on, too, though. Okay. Uh, she's coming in. Done. And yes. Still ninth. Twelfth. Oh, my God. Ah, But everyone else still has to come in, so at least that's good news. And we do have much better pace than those fools, so that's good. And they're coming into the pits. Everyone's coming into the pits. We're back into 10th. Oh, we lost a place here. Maybe we can push into 6th place. Still a bit of a gap there. Two seconds. No, we're not catching up. Oh, you can't pass Woodford? What? Yes, you can. Come on. That shouldn't be too much of an issue there. Look at that. So easy. But I'm not getting any closer to the graph. That's a proper driver. Can I risk the engine? Yeah, now I can. Okay, go. Go, go, go. Maybe we can catch him. Oh yes, we're getting closer. Oh, we're getting really close. We're getting so damn close. Attack. Attack. And we're past. Yes. Neutral driving style. There we go. We have more fuel to burn. Okay. Looking good. Got ahead of the gray team. The Graf and Woodfoot. And here comes the finish line. No. Oh, fuck. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> Fucking hell. This always confuses me with... No, oh, final lap! Yeah, that's the final lap for the Nitro Ninja. The Nitro Ninja is always basically a lap ahead of us. So, mm, yeah, and a bit of, of a pace disadvantage we have there. How is our engine doing? Good. Uh, this is also good. Good. Yeah, fine. You can, can push. No, you can't. Because the tires are overheating. So now, 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 that is, that is the finish. And what a great race for us. That was really good. Sixth and eighth. Solid strategy. I think that worked well. Yeah, with their mixed bag of tires. I mean, such a small fuel tank too. You can't really make use of medium tires with that. Um, oh, this went... Went really well, but mainly because of the two crashes there. Otherwise, we would have been 8th and 10th. That's 12 points this time around. And 42 points. Beautiful. And we're even getting pretty close to Kitano Sport. Here we go. Some bonuses and a new level. Adaptability 18. And we have our unlocks back after this little event where we had to piss off the race mechanics. And the game is saving. And you know what that means. It means that I hope you enjoyed this very solid race. And that I see you guys next time. <laughs>